Microsoft just launched AI-powered Bing search engine. This new Bing was made possible by a $10 billion multi-year partnership with OpenAI, which is actually the company that created the viral chat GPT, your action AI chatbot. By this implication, you don't necessarily need a chat GPT account. All you need is to visit www.bing.com, type in your comprehensive text prompt and hit enter. The new Bing will query her database and give you results from websites and blogs on the left hand side, of course, as usual. Then in addition, the new Bing will go ahead and query chat GPT's database and give you a comprehensive write-up shown on the left-hand side based on your text prompt. Almost exactly the same results you will get by typing the same text prompt in chat GPT. The most amazing thing is that inside the new Bing chat GPT result sidebar are embedded links. You can click on it to read more about the topic. By the end of this video, you will know how to use the new Bing AI powered by chat GPT. To access the new Bing, just visit www.bing.com. You can use any browser of your choice, be it um, Edge, Mozilla, or Chrome. So for this video, I will use Chrome. So I'll go ahead and type www.bing.com. So this is bing.com, all right? So we'll go ahead and click on chat. It says chat mode is only available when you have access to the new Bing. Now, this is what it looks like. I'll go ahead and say introducing the new Bing, your AI powered answer engine. I'll go ahead and join the waitlist. So I'll click on join. Okay, so you will need to log in, okay? Good, so I'll provide my password, Axel. Then I will sign in. All right, so I just sign in uh, into Microsoft. Now it says, great, you are on the waitlist. So I just joined the waitlist. Now you can go ahead and assess the new being faster by doing some things like um, setting Microsoft default on your PC and scanning QR code and download the Bing app and stuff like that. So um, this, let's not talk about that right now. Now you are on the waitlist. So very soon, I will receive um, the new Bing AI, okay, when it gets to my turn. But before that, let's go ahead and learn um, more about this particular new Bing, okay? If I click on learn more, now it says introducing the new Bing, ask three questions, get complete answers, chat, and create, okay? Already on the wait list. Now, this is what it looks like, ask anything. Ask your questions, short, long, or anything in between. The more precise you ask, the better the answers. Okay, now this uh just the demo. It says create a three course menu. Okay, create a three course menu. If I try this on Bing, this is what I get. These are links, you know, from Bing search engines in engine as usual. Now this one is from Chat GPT on the right hand side. Okay, you can see it. So if I go back here and um, click on help plan, help plan my special anniversary trip, and I try it on Bing to see what it looks like, and you can see here it's writing, congratulations on your anniversary, and this is what it looks like, okay? So when I get the AI, I should be able to query Bing like this. I should be able to use Bing, you know? Whenever I search something, then I will have a chat GPT version of whatever I search. Write a rhyming poem, okay? If I try this on Bing, you can see I will get something here. Here is what I generate for you. These are rhyming poems, okay? From Bing. This is powerful, okay? So if you are not yet on, on Bing, it's time to start using Bing, okay? Now, help me find a pet. I'll try it on Bing. And you see, picking the best dog breed for you depends on several factors such as lifestyle or any energy level or stuff like that. So click here and it keeps writing just like chat GPT. Now this is what 
you expect to get when it gets to your turn remember we we are already on the wait list so when we get our own ai this is how we're gonna use bing as simple as that for now if i go right here okay this is bing and uh, let me close this and i just type um coming home for example and hit enter i won't get that stuff here okay that you know chat gpt stuff on the right hand side it won't show because i'm yet to get my own ai i'm just on the waiting list so when i get the ai i should be able to use bing like this okay this is bing plus chat gpt if you are yet to get one go ahead and get on the wait list all right guys so that is all we need to know about new bing chat gpt when i get my own ai i should be able to explore these features more